Frog and toad all year. Down the hill. Frog knocked at toad's door. Toad, wake up, he cried. Come out and see how wonderful the winter is. I will not, said toad. I am warm in my own bed. Winter is beautiful, said frog. Come out and have fun. Blah, said toad. I do not have any winter clothes. Frog came into the house. I have brought you some things to wear, he said. Frog pushed a coat down over the top of toad. Frog pulled snow pants up over the bottom of toad. He put a hat and a scarf on toad's head. Help! cried Toad. My best friend is trying to kill me. I am only getting you ready for winter, said Frog. Frog and Toad went outside. They tramped through the snow. We will ride down this big hill on my sled, said Frog. Not me, said Toad. Do not be afraid, said Frog. I will be with you on the sled. It will be a fine, fast ride. Toad, you sit in front. I will sit right behind you. The sled began to move down the hill. Here we go, said Frog. There was a bump. Frog fell off the sled. Toad rushed past trees and rocks. Frog, I am glad that you are here, said Toad. Toad leaped over a snowbank. I could not steer the sled without you, Frog, he said. You are right. Winter is fun. A crow flew nearby. Hello, crow, shouted Toad. Look at Frog and me. We can ride a sled better than anybody in the world. But Toad, said the crow, you are alone on the sled. Toad looked around. He saw that Frog was not there. I am all alone, screamed Toad. Bang! The sled hit a tree. Thud! The sled hit a rock. Plop! The sled dived into the snow. Frog came running down the hill. He pulled Toad out of the snow. I saw everything, said Frog. You did very well by yourself. I did not, said Toad. But there is one thing that I can do all by myself. What is that? asked Frog. I can go home, said Toad. Winter may be beautiful, but bed is much better. The end.